Ha ha! Hello, my hearties. A very good evening to you, Dinky Doo. It's me, Scotty McClue. Wednesday evening, quarter past nine. Nothing gets past me just after quarter past nine. You know, nine fifteen to ten o'clock. That sort of time. Always an excellent time for everybody. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Doo from me, Scotty McClue. Hashtag for tie. The first lord of the internet. How good is that? Lovely to be with you. Danny's just joined us. Welcome, Danny. And Dinky Doo from me, Scotty McClue. We are, of course, live on the big one. Tiny bit of linear work required there. That's the one. That's better. Fantastic. Good evening. Good evening, Danny. Lovely to have you with us. The lovely Maria Knight has joined us. Welcome, Maria. So good to have you with us and a big dinky do to you. Excellent stuff. Lovely guys. Now, uh, we're talking Wednesday evening and we're talking watching Scotty McClue live on the videos uh, on TikTok as well. Lots and lots of new stuff uploaded for you today and on the YouTube channel, some new stuff uploaded there. So get on to that as well. You'll see the URL just in front of you. Get joining and telling 10. When are you going to go back on the radio? Danny, as soon as possible, as soon as somebody will have me. Your problem is we're talking jukebox radio nowadays. Very, very risk averse programmers. So, uh, you know, it's, it's very difficult for a really big talk show. You know, you've got small sort of radio companies doing a version of talk radio, but they're not talking and interacting properly with the people. So there we are. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Uh, now, lots and lots of videos for you though, Danny. I don't know if you've managed to see them all, but if you click the top left, there's a plus sign there. And if everybody follows and then has a good look at the videos, it should be pretty dinky do. Said Scotty, absolutely, Elise. Hey, brother, dinky do. Nicks, good to have you with us, brother. And well done. Lovely to have you with us. Nick Steak, uh, top man, you were on earlier, and so was I. That's how I knew you were on, you see. Wonderful to have you with us, and welcome, welcome, welcome. Ali's joined us, Dinky Doo, good to have you with us. Uh, I agree with the radio nowadays, they're trying to control what you're saying. I know, there's no personalities, local radio, proper chat, a laugh, a smile, a giggle. When did you last hear a Dinky Doo bo booming and blooming out of your radios and televisions? Who sent me a gift there? Somebody sent a big gift. Do you support the LGBTQ? Is this a troll's line or is it a genuine question? Uh, so there you are. Why was you swearing? Was it after nine? I wasn't swearing at all. I've never sworn on the radio. So there you go. Oh, yeah, my uh, whole family loves your accent. I thank you, Nick. Dinky do. No, 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 no. That's not swearing. If it's the one I think you're talking about, it's being used properly. Yes, absolutely. Good evening, Sir Scotty. Genuine. Good evening, Dinky do. So genuine, genuine. Yes, LGBTQS. It needs to be. Morning from Sydney, Australia, Scotty. We're still in level four lockdown. I'm so sorry to hear that. Not a good place to be. Scottish independence. Gary, yeah, I'm a bit uncertain of some of the nationalists who are a little bit narrow-minded and some of them aren't quite into the royal mode yet. We need to ensure that the Queen is fully 100% acknowledged as our head of state for Scotland in an independent Scotland. Lachmair, hello, dinky do Lachmair. We should all love everyone. I agree, Nick. Come on, Scottish independence. Yes, Shani. I think Scotland could do very well economically, but under the crown. Very important. Otherwise, it's a non-starter. Morning, the Duke of Dundee. Good morning, Onion Badgie. Lovely to have you with us. And dinky do. Nope, says Gary. Nope, what, Gary? What are you talking about? Yes, what does nope mean? Nope to what? We don't know what you're talking about here. Come and join us as soon as you possibly can. Ross has just joined us, Dinky Doo. We're watching Scotty McClue, hashtag float high, the first lord of the interdate. Uh, so would you support an independent Scotland with the Queen remaining as head of state? Well, of course, Danny. So there we are. Mickey Tricky, we're just going to send you straight down the Swanee for being an idiot. There he goes, gone, gone. Okay, fantastic. Bye-bye, Mickey. Uh, hey, Scotty, dinky do. Guys, remember never, ever, ever, ever to troll Scotty McClue. It's just a big no-no for you, and it's a big no-no for the live stream. All right, this is not your ordinary live where you come on and see a lot of cack. 
Why were you took off radio? I was took off radio because they wanted to put on love songs instead because it was easier to manage. Uh, do you watch an American football? I haven't seen one for years, Nick. Scotty, are you a Highlander or a Lowlander? 50%, both. So would an independent Scotland under the crown be similar to the situation in Canada or Australia? No, it'd be similar to the situation now in Scotland. There we are, independent without the monarchy. Forget that, Gary, that's it, finished. That would be toast. They'd kick independence into the long grass forever. Okay, so just so that you know. Don't send me down the swanee. No, of course I won't, Alice. You're not trolling. Down the swanee, Geodog, you're quite right. Geodog, you've changed your hat. You're wearing your Glengarry, am I correct? There we are, lovely to have you with us, Celtic Rangers. My advice would be go and see them both play and then make your mind up. That's your best chance. They're both excellent teams. Uh, don't troll Scotty McClure. I know, it's so simple. And yet these halfwits still do it. So there you are. On they come with their daftness. Uh, that's fine. But they're used to doing that, you see, to other people's lives. So there we are. No, 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 no. Alith, we will never send you down the swanny, my dear. You're not trolling. So there you are. Do not panic. Smilo's joined us. Tommy Robinson's joined us. Lovely to have you with us. And a big dinky do to you live on TikTok's top talk show. Hello from Castle Douglas in the south of Scotland. We love Castle Douglas. Castle Douglas, Kirkubri, Dalbeti. Wonderful. Are the badges for sale? Not yet, Liam, but as soon as they are, we'll let you have one. There you go, my dear fellow. Scotty McClure says, Dink you do. Good evening, Scotty. Good evening, Aaron. Live your life because life is short. Love who you want because one day you'll die and leave them. Oh, thank you for cheering us all up with that one. You should come up with a jingle for a brand. We've got stacks of jingles, Nick, but we can't play stuff on here because of the copyright. I mean, have you looked up the Scotty McClure mega mix? Ah, good sir, with my mess dress para wings. Yes, indeed. Absolutely, Geodog. We love it. Sorry, not at all. No, no, no problem at all. Dinky do, Scotty. Absolutely unknown. The people that troll you won't get a reaction, don't know why they keep trying. They are very, very strange. I just think they're not very bright upstairs. Anybody that trolls a Scotty McClue live lacks intelligence and maturity. There we are. I like your badge. I thank you very much. It is a belter. Have you ever thought of doing a podcast? Well, Danny, what's the difference to the Scotty McClue YouTube channel? Have you heard all the YouTubes on there? You know, it's fantastic. You just click on the URL in front of you right now. You'll see it beside my bio, below my bio. Dinky do, it's Scotty McClure. How do you do? That would be a very good jingle, Nick. Well done. I have my trusty water, guys. Mm. They are full of, full of shecht. Elith, you're right. <coughs> oh dear, I spoke too soon. That went down the wrong way. Hello, Scotty. Hope things are well. Thoughts on Mr. Tom? We love Mr. Tom. Good night, Mr. Tom. How beautiful is that? I always wear my Glen Gary to the Scottish Pipe Band Contest. Excellent. There we are. Fantastic. Do join us as soon as you can, Ian Leet. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome, I say. Great stuff. Now, who else have we got? Oi, oi, it's Eli. Good evening, Scotty from Laura. Laura, lovely to have you with us and welcome. So nice to see you. I love to see these names. No offense, Scotty, not at all, Oli. Anything to talk about cities, Greenbelt, monarchy? Well, we're always talking about something. I don't, can't understand why people can't get their head round that the monarchy is an excellent thing for the UK. <clears throat> you may have gone over this, but do you sell Scotty McClure stuff? Um, not at the moment, Nick. But we have done. We will go back to that. See, Scotty McClure is in his 30th year. So we're into the next generation. And I remember being with a friend at a fast food place on Saturday night. And out came a gentleman to deliver our food. And he said, I love your radio thing, by the way. I thought, amazing. Younger generation. I don't see why people have any issues with the monarchy. There are no issues with the monarchy. These people are so stuffed with nonsense. I'm making a baldric for my Blackbeard costume. 
Excellent. Arr, arr, oith. I think you do shots and hats would be wide. Fun fact I learned today is that Arizona and the British Isles are almost the same size. If I scream it as Sean, you're a top man, a geographer, an astronomer, a scientist. How can you be in your 30th year when you're only 30 yourself? I started young. Yes, it did. So true, Scotty. You say it best. Absolutely. What's your views on Meghan Markle? Happy birthday, Meghan. Shame that you actually dumped on the people that had given you everything. So there we are. Scotty, I often see Piper's wearing a headdress looking like a Busby. What's that called? That geodog is the feather bonnet. Yes, a feather bonnet. And you'll see the Pipers with that beautifully soft feathers with the red and white dicing or green and white dicing or I've even seen blue and white dicing round a feather bonnet. But normally it would be red and white checking. Evening Scotty from the beautiful Airdrie. Absolutely jump off at the cross. Have a whack round the tune. I was learning. I thought Baldrick was off Black Adder. I've just looked it up. Well, Baldrick, of course, is off Black Adder. I love these characters. I love you, Noho McCain Brooks. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Come on, Scotty, let's get back to the single bumps. Well, Sutherland 60, yes, indeed. Your eyes are a lovely shade of blue. They're gorgeous. You are so very, very kind. I thank you, meep de meep. I watched the Miles interview last night. Interesting stuff. He said he'd do a phone in each night. Yes, indeed, Big John. Yes, he would. Because he knows the value of a phone in. Nowadays, they're trying to get away with it and just hoping that night times television time and they get off of that. See, when I joined radio at 10 o'clock, people said, Oh, you're mad. That's the graveyard slot. Nobody will be listening. Only quarter of a million a half hour. There we are. Fantastic. That's just a local station. Scotty, what's your favorite fact? My favorite fact is that the Queen is a huge asset to Scotland. Um, hi, I'm MSM's brother, Football Matt. Lovely to have you with us. Welcome. We enjoy having an MSM on here. So we enjoy having you on. It's made for three flintlock pistols. What is? There we are. Do a flip. Oh, no, no. I did a flip earlier. The blood rushes to my head. Oh, takes me a minute to recover. The only thing I got wrong is that McClue's good for 10 years. Wrong is good for any time. Absolutely. I think that was maybe a sort of political with a small P because John was no longer in control of McClue's phone-in, you see. I agree with him about the phone-ins. Well, of course, when I think of a Scottish piper, that's the image to see him wearing the feather bonnet. That's it, Geodog. I mean, we used to have a lovely guy called Pipe Major Ronald Laurie in charge of the Glasgow Police Pipe Band, Big Ronnie. And uh, when he put the feather bonnet on, he must have been about six foot seven. Uh, would you legalize the herbal, Scotty? No, Jason, we don't need any of that. We don't need drugs. We don't need alcohol. We don't need tobacco. We don't need drug dealers. We don't need any of that cack in our society. I saw your phone ends. Feisty, very feisty. You are mad lad, very mad lad. But a good lad, not a bad lad. See what I just did there? A little bit of poetry for you. He even said because he used a pseudonym, people would complain about John Morgan to him. Yes, they did. They used to phone him up and complain to him about himself. I've taken complaints as well, you know, in the station about Scotty McClue and just told them, yes, yes, well, I'll have a word with him. That He said, you sound a bit like him. I said, we all sound the same here. It's a house style. Right, I, Scotty, it's Holly that you muted yesterday. I'm so sorry. I meant to say night, night, Scotty. Well, Holly, we'll unmute you then. There's no problem at all. If I have muted you, I don't remember muting you. Uh, do you have a new hat? Yes, Stefan. Uh, you ready for the square go, Scotty? Jason, you would never, ever, ever, ever even consider a square go with Scotty McClue. Because you'd end up in the middle of next week and then some. Fantastic. Yes, I'm back. You'd be better learning to fight your way out a wet paper bag first. Uh, is the first in line to the throne always given the title Prince of Wales? Uh, yes, they are, Sean, unless, uh, you see, Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth was first. When her father, George VI, died. So there you are. Absolutely incredible. But that. 
I wanted to buy Team It's Only Radio, but I can't see it in my local bookstore. I'll ask. Uh, you should be able to pick them up unknown. I mean, try on the internet. Um, I remember seeing one in the Salvation Army for uh, for 10 pence, I think. Uh, but it's a good read. It's well worth it. It's a good book. There we are. Uh, and I think John gave the profits to charity. Ed Zick, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Thomas Love, lovely to have you with us. Excellent stuff and dinky do. Uh, share the videos if you can. Scotty, I've got your back with a square go. Excellent stuff. Now, who have we got? He had money going to charity. Yes, that's right. Yes, indeed. You may have already answered, but you're going back on the radio soon. Laura, the problem is the radio is just two companies playing one big jukebox. You know what I mean? It's a bit, it's a bit. Lackluster, really, isn't it? Uh, here we go. If you find Scotty, but you're already had Zeds on the floor. Absolutely. Especially if you couldn't fight sleep. What's your best? Cousin Rory is on live as well. Excellent. You're the best. Sorry. My cousin Rory is on live as well. Not at all, Holly. No problem at all. I can't have blocked you if you're talking to me. Now, B edits. This to reveal rubbish that you've put there, the kind of cack that you would stick on to maybe another live that you're used to trolling. Now, absolutely no use here. This is a highly intelligent talk show. You need to raise your game. Okay, and maybe intelligence reveal. Can we try that? IQ reveal. We'll try that. Okay, now be edits. I won't put you down the swanee tonight because I think there's a chance you could grow up. That's it. Just grow up. Hi, hi, Zim, Zum. Hi, Scotty. Any swords in the gaff, Scotty? Ah, Jason, we don't reveal what's in the gaff. Uh, we've got the gaff shoes, dinky you know? Yay. Okay, be edits. Otherwise, you're toast down the swanee lifetime ban. So grow up time, son. That's what it's about. I mean, Scotty. There we are, Ruri, MSM, and Max S. What's your plans for the future? Well, Laura, I'm going to be speaking to some very senior people tomorrow about perhaps saving the broadcast operation. So there we are. I do a lot of that as well, what we call crisis management. And boy, have they got a crisis. So there we are, the best Scottish curse. We don't put curses on people. So even the person that stole my life savings, I don't put a curse on them. So there we are. So B edits, to reveal, right. Okay, B edits. What's going to happen to you now is you're going doon the swanee for being an idiot. Guys, are we ready to send B dot edits 22 doon the swanee? Here it goes. Lifetime ban for B dot edits. There he goes. Block. Block by Tarala is gone. That's him doing the swanny with him. Uh, good evening. What does that mean? No, it's just an idiot. It means nothing. It's people that troll other people's lives and they don't realize this is totally different. There we go. Are the badges for sale? No, but we'll get them. Can you make us laugh? Holly, how can I possibly make you laugh for goodness sake? I am Dot Steely and I used to be a stand up comedian till I was asked to sit down. I am still sending me TikToks, you generous person. Get back in the wireless, Scotty boy. Okay, Banky boy. Lifetime ban for him. He's gone. He's gone. Yeah, doing the swanny with E dot. There you are. Did you get scammed for your life saving? Yes, I did smick too. Yes, a guy that um, I'd worked with before. And uh, he just lied, cheated, and stole. Incredible. But there we go. Uh, doing the swanny with these people, I say. Bye-bye, Giza, so long. There is gone 25 beautiful TikToks from IM.Steel. What does doing the swanny mean, Matt? Down the swanny river. Yes, just away down the river, gone floating away. No more scrolling, no more trolling. What is your dream car? Luxury cars, we've been here before, I think. Probably a Cloud 3. Oh, that sorted you out, hasn't it? You'll be going, what's that? There we go. Hey there, Poolside in Destin, Florida. We love you, Poolside. In Destin, Florida, I am still here. There we are. The swan is where the trolls are sent. Make us laugh saying dinky do a few times. Oh, Holly, you're not supposed to laugh at dinky do. Uh, so there we are. 
Do you think the vaccines are being forced on people? Well, there's certainly a lot of pressure for everyone to get vaccinated. I can tell you that because they want to cut down on the COVID, you know, from that point of view. Doing the Swanee and doing the Dingley Dell. Thank you for beautiful hand heart, Maria. You are an angel. Maria is so generous. There we go. Now, did your con man face justice? Well, he did eventually. Not from me, though, because I don't think he would have had any money and we'd had enough of him in our life. But uh, I know that he was a convicted fraudster very, very soon afterwards. And he's done a lot of frauds since. And one day, seven and a half thousand pounds disappeared from the company bank account. And this was him trying to pay off a top lawyer for defending him for fraud at his previous employment. Just a lifetime of absolute badness. Remember, guys, stop, don't scroll, and never troll. Always stop with Scotty McClue. Do you like football? Not really. Were you able to get your money back, or did he get done by the police? Uh, I think he's been done since. Yes, it was definitely a criminal charge, but I don't know. I never get any money back now. The actual Swanee River's near me. Where are we? I am still here. Tell us exactly the home of the Swanee. Oh, such a beautiful car. You do know luxury cars? Yep, absolute. And, of course, the V8 Rover P5. How big is your dinky-doo? My dinky-doo is 30 years and 50,000 hours big. That is big, isn't it? There's a new Rolls Royce showroom in Piccadilly. Yes, H.R. Owens. I know H.R. Owens very, very well. Do you remember Jack Barclays as well? They were fancy. Creamers of South Kensington. These are all your top people. Roland Square Sausage. My car's the one that gets me to point to be alive. Geodog. That's what about. The Willie's Jeep would suit you. Fantastic. Is that you getting a degree in the picture behind you? Yes, Banky boy. There's Lord Reith, the beautiful Labrador. Oh, what a gorgeous dog. Fantastic. The con man didn't even deserve Scotty's biceps. No, no. We just waved the con man away out the road. Uh, it's Scotty and his dog, Lord Reith. Thank you, dear Scotty, was listening to John Morgan's interview about Team It's Only Radio. Absolutely wonky. Is there a trap door behind the photo frame, Scotty? Oh, yes. I make a quick escape. In a yellow submarine. Guys, I'll bet you nobody's followed me on here tonight. Has anybody followed me? Get following, please. Tap the top left-hand corner. There's the plus button. And just go follow the host. And that's you. Please do it. Anybody not following, just do it. Jason, you've followed, haven't you? There we are. How did he rip you? A business deal gaze on just thorough dishonesty. You know, you couldn't turn your back at him for a second and he was away with anything that was coming in. We thought what was coming in was going to the business and it was going in his back pocket. Yes, indeed. Hello from Moscow. Hello, Mr. Bumba in Moscow. Previat, previat. I say to you. Yes, indeed. And does Vedania? Previa, thank you, thank you. I'm sorry, sir, I thought you were the captain in Spongebob for a second. Love the energy. Not at all, Busan. I am Scotty McClue on TikTok. What's dinky-doo? Dinky-doo means it's all well with you and the world. That's it. Rover is over. Sadly, sadly. I loved the 110. 110 S was it, the last big P4. Beautiful. Six under. Remember, a, a friend of mine, a veterinary surgeon, senior veterinary surgeon, said, you see, there's a tremendous difference between a four-cylinder car and a six-cylinder car. <laughs> Why well, area do you live now? We're back in Glasgow at the moment. I have to go, but beyond 10 minutes. Yes, it did. Football, Matt. Stay with us for 10 minutes. The Cloud 3 is such a long, beautiful bonnet with a lots of shiny bits. That's it, luxury cars. Wouldn't thank you for the latest models, I'm afraid. Sup, 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 Sergeant, sup. Yes, sup. General sup. Oh, that 
that's lush. Absolutely amazing. Do you have a dog? I don't now, Holly. I did until eight weeks ago when Lord Clyde passed away. He was the successor to Lord Reith. There he is there. Whoa. Amazing guy. Uh, did I ask? You always ask, Darren, remember? I have. I have. Everybody's asked. Now, is that straight body, Scotty boy? That's what a Ryan boy. I'll tell you. General Sop. Watching the Olympics, there we are, skateboarding. Thought it was the local park. I'm in labour having my baby Goodwin Holly. Good luck. Hello from the USAR, Kansas. Thank you, Boomba, for following Scotty McClue. What a beautiful thing to do. Guys, if you haven't followed, get following. Nice hearing your voice again. It's been too long. Glad I recognised your voice. When scrolling, did you just discover me scrolling? I tell them never to scroll and never to troll. But maybe that would stop them discovering Scotty McClue. Hello from London. So there we are. Did you ever eat Scottish shortbread biscuits? All the time, Dub. We love it. <laughs> now then, the new hybrid Range Rover Vogue has claimed MPG as 73 MPG. Wow. Uh, how would you say hybrid? Are you talking electric? Mm, hybrid to me, you see, means petrol paraffin uh, in a marine engine. A Kelvin, the old Kelvin petrol paraffin, or the petrols. The K2. A big hello from Adrian in Ireland. We love you in Ireland, Adrian. Dink you do, I say. Lovely to have you with us now. Fantastic. Who have we got here? Have you ever seen the Bankies play? Oh, yes. Scotty, could you tell us about your youth growing up in Scotland? It was a wonderful, wonderful place to grow up. But you see, I didn't go and play football. I uh, went on a boat as crew. So I would cycle from school and join the boat and go over to get the American sailors from the Holy Loch and bring them back for liberty. Oh, tremendous experience. 12 years old. Mostly electric, but with a small diesel tank. Nah, that's, uh, that's not for me, luxury cars. You need something minimum V, uh, minimum six cylinder, uh, preferably V8, probably V12. That's an engine. There we are. Bye. Bye, Scotty. Holly, dear. Take care. Favourite penny sweet? or oh, the penny dainty. The penny dainty. Without a doubt. Yes, yes, absolutely. Come and join us. If you've just arrived, you're watching Scotty McClue, the first lord of the internet. This is big stuff. Welcome, welcome, I say. I find these so interesting. Thick pigeon. I think the thing is that everybody does. The wee trolls will scroll past. That's great. The intelligencer will stop immediately and join in. And this is just amazing. I love your random raps. Did you see I popped one up for you? You did ask. I'm saving up for my dream car. I want some recommendations for Royces. What could we get you? The R-Type. I'm more of an S-Type, to be honest with you. I would think, what about an S-Type Bentley? Or what about a T-Type? What about a Shadow 2, no? My only worry about the Shadow was the umbrella handbrake was right at my knee, where I like to have my knee. Ecolelio, uh, the McClure radio phone in. Fantastic, that's what it's about now. We are talking. I say, brilliant. Uh, I, indeed, I indeed own a CJ2A Willys Jeep. Geo Dog, I can't believe you. You are amazing. How are you doing? Geo Dog is in South Africa. He is one of the world's most intelligent men. He and I were bantering back and forward with a few facts. He was talking to me about a car getting him from A to B. I said to him, you need a Willys Jeep. He said to me, he's in South Africa, remember? He said to me, I do indeed own a Willys Jeep. Wow. <laughs> My father drove one of these. Kirk and Tillock sends his regards. We love Kirky. Stevie boy. Tremendous. That's what it's all about. Uh, unknown fantastic stuff. Thank you for the big smiles. 
Angrid, lovely to have you with us. Please do another Spaces, Spaces on Twitter. Follow Scotty McClue on Twitter at Scotty McClue. Go on to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel and subscribe. Go on to Scotty McClue's Twitch. Uh, where were you on the radio? Everywhere, Shane. International, national, local, the lot. 35 radio stations in the major markets, 40 years. What a beautiful gift from Maria Knight. Thank you, Maria. You are so kind. The shadows are lovely, but sadly overproduced. And get one for 5K on eBay, and then you start paying. Fantastic. Thank you. Good evening, Scotty. Uh, I remember saying to a friend of mine at the auction ward, buying a Roland Square Slice sausage, a Roland Lawn, a Roland Slice, and a cup of tea. And I heard them say, for £600, thank you, gentlemen. It's your bid, sir. And uh, the car's yours, sir. That was it. And I said to my pal, I says, there's that big rover away for 600 quid. He said, I wait till he gets that into naming a fast service place, you know. So there you go. Do you like golf? I don't play. I don't dislike it. Fantastic. Shout out to Madison, please. Thank you. Hello from Yorkshire. Noah. Lovely to have you with us in Yorkshire. How dinky do is that? I am the world's own, the world's only honorary Yorkshireman. Because I've lived in Yorkshire for so long, you see, fantastic. My dad did say that you were. Yes, Shane, check with your dad. I bought it at an army auction, very lovingly restored it. Dear dog, did that cost you a fortune? I would guess you're a man who knows what he's doing. Did you do it yourself? <laughs> and can you get the parts for a Willie's Jeep? What's the best place you've been on holiday and where would you go if you could? I think the best place I've been on holiday is Tarbert in Argyle. And uh, yes, yes, I'd, of course I'd go if I could. Yes, the Tarbert Hotel or the West Loch Hotel. There we are. When it's finishes, when it finishes. Oh, yes, I see what you mean. Yes, absolutely. Kieran has just joined us. Welcome, welcome. If you've just arrived, you're watching Scotty McClue, hashtag Floatai, the first lord of the internet, the world's top broadcaster, the world's most humble man, just so nobody thinks I'm doing any trumpet blowing, you know, that sort of thing. I love your bonnet. I thank you, thank you, bye. The Rhodesian and South African military used them well into the 70s. Geodog, I was just going to say, did you have the a lot of old British stuff in South Africa pre sort of apartheid and that was there still a lot of stuff remaining uh, you know a lot of a lot of remainders did you say dinky do to Mason today MSN he'd really appreciate it of course I can we can always say dinky do to Mason fantastic. What are some of your favourite movies? Well, we were just talking about the most recent one, The Imitation Game. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Alan Turing. Uh, you know, we're talking about that. Benedict Cumberbatch playing Alan Turing. Outstanding performance. The wonderful Charles Dance. Uh, another great one, The Wild Geese. Um, another great one would be Where Eagles Dare. Reach for the Sky. Called it the guns of Navarone, Force 10 from Navarone, the heroes of Telemark. You know, there's a, a few to be going on with. Have you seen any of the Downton Abbeys? I haven't seen many, but I saw one last week. I was at a friend's house and we watched it. I found you through strolling months back. So glad I found you. Fantastic. What a privilege to have you on that. We, guys, would you not agree we are an amazing band of people? Tremendous stuff. Welcome, welcome. So if anybody's scrolling, stop and join Scotty McClue. That's what it's about. Never scroll and never troll, I say. Wonderful, wonderful. Who have we got? Everybody joining us here. Some man for the one man has joined us. Welcome some man for the one man. There we go. Have we shared? Can we have some shares and some follows? Indeed, yes. Land Rovers, Saracens, Chieftain Tanks, Shackletons. Shackleton's as in Shackleton bombers. You know, the Shackleton was effectively a Lancaster. I'm pretty sure it was. And we used to have them for air sea rescue. So when they announced that there was some 
problem and somebody had gone missing, they would say, a sh an RAF Shackleton is helping in the search. There we are. I'm going to Hampton Court Palace for a few days. Have you been to any of the palaces? Every single one of them. Luxury cars. My first visit to Blenheim Palace was at the age of seven years old. Tremendous. Churchill was still around. We're the best of the best on here, Scotty. I'm all McClued up on my McClued knowledge. Unknown username. You are a top journalist. You will have been writing about that. I hope you've enjoyed it and found some interesting things. There we are. Do Did you do national service? Uh, well, Kulelo. Uh, I didn't do national service, but enough said, I say. Fantastic. There we are. What about that? TikTok's too soft for Scotty. You should be on the phone and sorting out the numpties. It's your duty. Do you know what, Tommy? I 100% agree. I don't think TikTok's too soft. I think TikTok's fabulous for Scotty McLean. Yes, I went to Blenheim Palace two days ago at a tour of the staterooms in a beautiful luxury house. Did you see the door that weighs, does it weigh a ton or something or two tons or three tons? I can't remember. Very, very heavy front door and a beautiful lock on it. The Point 303 was only replaced in 1962 by the Finn Fowl. Now, the Point 303, is that a Lee Enfield geodog? That's what I want to know. Wonderful stuff. My father had a Winchester and uh, he had all sorts of early, early shotguns and um, fantastic, of course, Hollands, Pardis, all these things. Uh, Tommy, yes, but he sends people doing the Swanee on TikTok nowadays. Yes, we cut them off. We send them doing the Swanee for trolling, for cheeking up, I say. Here we are. Had a TT potentially resurrected your radio career or did it never stop? TT. Galelo, you've actually lost me there with TT. Yes, I'll have to think about that. I heard your thoughts on the media. Why do you think the media has gone down the road it has? Uh, just because it's all becoming propaganda serving the masters, doing what you're told. This is all this thing, do what you're told. Uh, this is where you'll, you'll, you'll stifle creativity terrifically. I was, I was very, very fortunate. I was just given a blank platform. Well, it's your show. You fill it with what you like, but make it good. We want audience. So I was the creative practitioner, you see. Now people are told what to do, and you never not do, do what you're told. And that's radio and television over the back. So I'm afraid the creativity has gone. The pioneering side of radio and television has gone. It's been taken over by automatons. And you'll never ever get the creativity back. So repeats, put that in, it looks interesting, it fits. Put that in, put that in. Uh -huh, uh -huh. There's the same song again. The DJ said nothing. You know, and that's that's it for you. So, you know. Uh, yes, sir, the Shackleton was used for long-range coastal patrols. Geodog, amazing. Did you ever jump out of a Shackleton? You know, what sort of stuff? I know you jumped out the Douglas Dakota. Uh, do you have any 12 boars? I have a Beretta Silver Pigeon and a Browning. Wow. No, I don't have any guns at all now, although I am a crack shot. But I don't use uh, I don't use guns. I just spent the day in Stirling, beautiful town. Banky, boy, dinky. Do. Have you seen the film Dancing with the Wolves? Uh, I haven't, but I've heard of it. So there we are. Has TT given you more media work? Oh, I see what you're at, Kalela. Yes. Or did your career in media never stop? My career in media has never stopped or faltered. It's always gone on in some shape or form. You know? Yes, sir. Uh, there we are. The SMLE used to buy the Brits in WW1 and 2. So there you go. Fantastic. The SM Lee Enfield. Wow, Geodog. Amazing. John Reith was actually in charge of Lee Enfield in America. Doubled the output. Great man. Now, you see, there's where Churchill was a very, very, very bad man. 
because he said that John Reef needed cutting down to size. And genius, an industrialist, not a good father or husband, but an excellent industrialist. And that was Churchill. And the two of them fell out and never spoke at the end of their lives. In fact, Reith refused to take Lady Reith to Churchill's funeral, although they had tickets. No, sir, we only jumped out the DC through Kota as well. Uh, yes, absolutely. And she was the one with the prop wash. Is that right? There we go. But, I mean, wonderful. It's a Dakota, an American uh, Dakota sitting, uh, sorry, a, a USAF Dakota sitting at Sola Airfield to take my father back in 1944. So my father must have jumped out of the Dakotas as well. Uh, but I didn't ask him. If I wish he was here, I could ask him about the prop wash. Dinky do, dinky do, everybody. Lovely to have you with us. Three more minutes and then we have to dash off. Lovely to have you tonight. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining us. What a successful life. It's always well worth doing, guys, just for the quality chat. That's what it's all about. Dinky do. Please can you do a book? I know you've done the reading of Deliver Us From Evil, but I can't find the full thing. Well, we don't have the full thing. It's not up there. Just chapter one. Did you like it? Did you hear Deliver Us From Evil? Did you like the mystique? Yes, was it quite good? A wee cliff hang up. When's your next live? We don't know luxury cars. We do random at the moment. Uh, it's all about the banter. Lauren Princess, it is indeed about the banter, as you so rightly say. There we are. We will we get part two, I must know. Undone. I shall have to read it. There we go. It is written. Is that Trump being, well, in actual fact, Cliff Deary? I think. The reason that Trump got so much bad propaganda at the end is because he's right. I think we should have Trump back, actually, and I'm not political, as you know. Thanks, Scotty. Love listening to your banter. Fantastic. How much for the badge? Luxury cars, they're not for sale, but we will get you one when we uh, become TikTok famous. So everyone's job is to follow Scotty McClue and share every single video because we want every TikToker on here. I agree, Trump said it like it is. I still wish I could have a signed poster. We will get you one. Fear not, my child. Yes, we will get you one. No doubt about it. Wonderful. Thank you for joining us. How many badges do you have? Not so many now. Uh, I've got one here. I've got two on here. One in the front of the bonnet you're familiar with. One in the back of the bonnet in case that breaks down. And you being into luxury cars will know how high the risk of a breakdown is. Trump was ignorant to serious world issues where you see, well, I don't think he was. <clears throat> Again, if you take out any mainstream propaganda, you'll see a different Trump. And nowadays we've learned not to trust mainstream media because it's a mouthpiece for the wealthy. When we were kit laden, we'd get out of the C-130, the C-160 Hercules. I remember saying to a squadron leader friend of mine, I said, I saw a hurt last night. She was trailing kind of dirty smoke. I said, I was very worried about her. He said, don't worry, Scotty. She'd be all right. She'd probably refueled in America. And it just has a different effect on her engines. I meant behind you. Sorry, is that a bit of dough? No, no, it's not. Fantastic. I'm off hangers hunting. Thank you, no doubt the election was stolen. Well, it may well have been. We don't know the truth here. You know, climate change, Scotty. Trump swept it under the carpet. Well, you see, when you think about it, the climate will change anyway. It might be nothing to do with oil and gas. Might be nothing to do with carbon. Might be nothing to do with greenhouse gases. Although the, the, the vegans are putting out a lot of methane. You know, I know that. <laughs> you see, it might just be a natural phenomenon. Have you thought about that? And you won't change that by having a conference. Have Trump back. There, so there you are. In nearly broke America. Propaganda ran the Trump machine. Tommy, are we sure about that? Do you see what I mean? Have another think, because I was like you. I was a doubting Thomas. The goodbye song, the squeeze box, 
Right, goodbye, song or squeeze box. What is it to be? Your old contact, Selenius. Wouldn't get the radio nowadays. The world's got soft camera. It would get on the right station. There we are. We've gone too soft. You're right. We do know the truth. So there we are. The election was won by Biden. But do we? Think again, Tommy. Always have a think. Bonjour, my friend. Bonjour, monsieur. Uh, the climate change is naturally it's enhanced due to the emissions from fossil fuels. But will, do we know that? There we are. Hello, Scotty, my man. I've been looking through the Mr. Martin debate. What a bad man. Oh, la hoop. Yes, indeed. Squeeze box, squeeze box, squeeze box. Right. It looks like it's squeeze box, guys. Why don't I do a deal with you? We'll do squeeze box and goodbye song. <laughs> right. Are we ready? What do we want on the squeeze box? <laughs> Thank you so much, Maria. Maria says, thank you, Scotty. I love that tune. Bonnie Charlie's new wall. Will you know come back again? Oh, dear. I thought it was finished. It's finished now. Nice wee tribute to Elizabeth Scotty. Long may she reign. I loved the New Zealand national anthem. Thank you. Can you say hello to Sasha? I can indeed. The best song ever. What about that luxury cars? How amazing is that? And that's everybody up to date, dinky do. Hello from Florida. We love you, Keshush, in Florida. Fantastic. Where's our friend Steve who loves the squeeze box? We don't know if he's made it or not. Tremendous stuff, dinky do. I say Ruru has just joined us. A very warm welcome. To Ruru. That was beautiful as always, Scotty. You have a gift, La Hoop. Bless you. You are a man of many, many, many gifts. And don't ever forget that, Mr. La Hoop. I tell you, I know that. So there you are. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for watching. Have a beautiful night. Get on to the TikTok videos. Go on to the YouTube channel. We'll upload this live to YouTube later. So hit the URL in front of you underneath my bio, and that'll take you to the YouTube channel. Will you be next in an early bird pop-up? Quite possible. Curious thoughts on immigration in Scotland? We love it. Immigration is the lifeblood of Scotland. Fantastic. Scotland was depopulated through social injustice and is now repopulating through social justice. Uh, should Scottish cops wear the Glengarry hat? Nice idea, Scouser. 
There we are. Should they wear it when they come down to Blackpool to take care of the Scots at the Glasgow Fair? Same on the bank is the goodbye song. Right, Robert, here we go. <clears throat> everybody join in. Goodbye, everybody, goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. Have we to sing? Au revoir and a cheery oh. Did you hear a ra in au revoir? And Maria, thank you for my beautiful good night TikToks. You're such a beautiful angel. Bless you and dinky do. God bless you all. Take great care of your dear selves. Have a lovely, safe and peaceful good night. If you're just getting up, a very good morning to you. Have a beautiful day. If you're thinking about going to bed in America, have a lovely, lovely sleep when you get round to it. And have a lovely afternoon tea. This is Scotty McClure saying dinky-doo to every single one of you. ta